the system call or the function call we plan to use is the power all right and it, what it does is it computes the x to the power y and it returns a value right let's say z so it computes x to the power y and we'll store it in z okay so we have to know how to use this function pow okay let's take it let's go to our system so the way to get information about pow is m a n man p o w so the system shows as the manual so linux programmers manual about the function pow and uh, it shows three other functions that are kind of cousins or grouped or other functions that are grouped together one is pow one the other one is powf and powl so you always have this kind of functions that do the similar thing and they are grouped under the same uh, manual and it says we have to include m a t h stands for math dot h that contains the what the function does for us and uh, so there's three functions pow powf powl are here the let's look at the float okay let's take the simpler version the float powf okay it takes two parameters the type float float x and float y and it returns a float value which is nothing but x to the power y and it also goes and says you have to link your program with link with minus l m the m stands for math right and uh, I'm not sure if you are able to see it if you see that at the bottom it says press uh, you want this is just the first page if you want to go to the next page you just press the space bar and it talks about what the function does all right it says a description pow function returns the value of x raised to the power of y and sometimes they also talk about the return value what do you get out of it right on success these functions returns the value of x to the power of y okay if you keep pressing the space bar it'll go to the next page next page next page and talks about errors and it gives a lot of information sometimes you skip most of the time you skip a lot of information and you see here c also it talks about cbrt what is that so cbrt means cube root cow will see that and square root so there are functions and if you continue hitting the space bar if it doesn't move you have reached the end of the pages the way to go back to your prompt is to press q to quit and you go back to your prompt right so we looked into the man pages we know what we have to do right so let's go back and write the program i'm going to name it as pow itself dot c and we know we have to include the 
math.h and I'm going to call float x comma y comma z x equal say 3.0 y equal to and z equal p o w x comma y and print let's print the value to confirm right z is float is percent f end of line end quote comma and z so if you look at it, I just named 2. Point, instead of saying 2.0, I named it as, I gave the value just 2. Instead of that, I just gave 2. What it means is the compiler will promote the constant 2 to 2.0. It promotes it and ascends to the value of y because value of y is a float. So you can either do it as 2.0 or just two either way is the same but it's better always to put 2.0 all right so but x is a float y is a float as we saw in the man pages we should use p o w f for float right and uh, so it computes the value x to the power y and returns the value to z. Okay. Then we need to compile and link it. GCC minus LM. That means we are linking to the math library. POW dot C. Oops. There are some problems we have. What's that? I made mistake here. Okay. Okay. So you got to do the other way around. It's all right. So we got that under control. So dot a dot. So we got nine. Point O. Why is that? Three power two is nine. So we got the value nine, right? So that is how you use man pages to get information about the usage of functions.